In this video, I will create this curtain bangs style with an undercut that is ideal for people with curly hair. Roll the tape! I will prepare the hair with glide from 1821 to help facilitate the cut with the razor and the scissors. It works very well as a hair cutting lotion, creates a smooth and silky surface with natural ingredients and is also great for shaving. First, I will separate the interior from the stereo for this haircut using a horseshoe section. Using the detachable clippers with the 3.5 comb, I will cut the whole area on the undercut. Starting from the bottom and going up and taking off on the curve of the head. Just leaving it slightly graduated. With the 5-0 comb on my clippers, I will retouch the whole perimeter starting from the sideburns. This comb is so sharp that it adds like a nature. To make a low graduation fade on the nape, I will start using the metal comb number two. Lie two fingers high from the hairline. Follow me on Instagram to see what I'm going to be doing next and to see some videos on the behind the scenes. With the number one metal comb, polish the base by clipping in various directions depending on the direction of the calic. You want to go against the direction of the hair, as you can see me doing here, about one finger from the hairline. Use the comb to lift the hair or control the length if necessary. To cut the interior part of the style, separate the front to the back by using the comb as a reference. Using the point cutting technique, I will create a solid horizontal line just below the ear. In order to join the sides with the back, I will create a guy in the center of the back of the neck with the desired length. Connect the two lens using a diagonal back. Repeat the same technique on the opposite side. To cut the top area, I will use the twins comb technique. The intention here is to leave the hair long on the top and texturize it a little bit to facilitate the movement of the curls. Watch how I measure from the sides so as not to cut too much from the top. Cut a high graduation on the crest area. Tom is my next video on the channel, Baji from Tokyo Revengers with his short haircut. 
If you are interested in this type of style but your hair is straight, I'm going to leave a link on the corner so you can watch this video from Ruel. This one will be in a live model too. On the sides, I use this technique to create the same illusion of graduation that I did in the back, but without cutting so much hair. If you like this video you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up, and share with your friends. It makes the biggest difference. Thank you to all of you for your support. Let's see if you can get to 50,000 subscribers by the end of this year. I'm counting on you. Depending on the thickness, depending on the thickness of the hair, play a close attention to the following technique. This texturizing technique can help you to create different lengths within the style, but without losing the general length. This technique will definitely facilitate the movement and direction of the curls. Continue using horizontal sections and stressing the hair where is needed. On the top of the hair, use this particular technique to preserve more hair. The other technique which I just used on the sides and the back will be too much for this area. Paste the 1821 is my favorite product for wavy and curly hair, giving it the definition but it's still flexible and making it very manageable. When the hair is dry you can truly see the pattern of each curl. That's why I like to handpick some strands and cut it on dry so I can personalize this style. To activate the product on the hair, you can put a little bit of water on your hands and massage it through the hair. Okay, look like I sprayed too much water. This will give again the definition to the curl. If there is a lot of humidity where you live, use a little bit of hair spray to keep the hair where you want it, so it doesn't get too big or frizzy. This style will look great on almost all face types but it's no idea for very white faces. Since this style has an undercut, it will take away a lot of the volume on the side. That is one of the reasons that it makes it ideal for curly hair. This style, like most mid-length undercuts, can be combed into a ponytail that it looks good and very casual. As you can see, this undercut is not super short, so it works great for school and work. This is Angel Del Solar, the hairbender.